Hello everybody and welcome back to Lost Souls. As you can see we're in the middle of a red moon but it's going down so it won't be very long. Then we can carry on. So you can see here on the clock. In fact you'll also notice that because of the um, mega torch there are no mobs on this base. So let's go and trundle off to the twilight first. I'm going to check I've got everything first of all of course. Let's have a look. We don't need this drum with me but uh, let's dump that here I think it's probably a good place to go and put it at least where it belongs I should put it down here this was just a drum of um, liquid dawnstone I think what else have we got on here well I've got some tools I don't think there's anything else in here that's particularly special I probably should get rid of some of this stuff as well because it's taking up inventory space which I probably will need so let's get rid of let's get rid of this stuff first oh yes of course <laughs> there's a lot of it 512 blocks is uh, enough so even though I didn't put them in any particular order gosh Still takes a lot to get rid of, doesn't it? Just about filling up that chest with those. What else do we not need in here? Probably these things here. Torches, man, well, we keep torches with us. Redstone torches we definitely don't need. And the books. I think we can keep the rest of the stuff. I'll put the um, I'll put this pestle and mortar in here. And in fact, I want to put it in the right hand side. Yeah, this one will do fine. So let's go off to the twilight forest. Now it's sun sunlight's coming up, and see so if we can go and find that oil gas. So I should have with me the papers. I think they're in here. It's a bit of a sudden stop for music there. That's a bit strange. Why can I see that? <laughs> oh, why can't I see the map in the right place? That's most peculiar. <laughs> okay. Right, fine. So we're here. We need to go over here. So let's do that. Oops. You know, I don't ever remember seeing the map looking like this, but there we are. So today, hopefully, I've never done something else. I've never done the first time for that. It's the August. But why is it holding it in two hands as opposed to the normal one? So here it comes to the red part, and here's the tower. Obviously, I can, with flight, it probably makes this life a lot easier. Let's just put this away. Well, anyway, we'll start at the bottom and work our way up, as we're supposed to. So here's the doorways. I think we just right-click these and let it come open. And there's a skeleton there, so you can't see me. Which helmet have I got on, by the way? So look. I should really check I've got the night. This one here. Oh yes, night vision. We'll take the night definitely put the night vision helmet on. There we go. So lots of fires. I haven't actually prepared my other stuff either. Let's put <laughs> let's do that, because that would also be sensible. Why is that not on? Let's put that into there. Oh yes, that's better, isn't it? We can see now. So, various anvils and stuff like that might be worth taking these. Let's take these. And lots of furnaces. Oddly enough, that might not be so bad to take either. Not sure why we've got those, but we'll carry on up and see what we can find. So this looks like a, 
a sort of a trappy type area. <laughs> I've got no idea what's going on here. But let's. There's different levers. What happens if we flick these levers? Am I in danger? Oh, that turns the lights on. Very good. And presumably. Oh, that's opening doors. Is it? Of course, this is a lot. A lot easier with a <laughs> flight. I've got no idea what I'm supposed to be doing here. Absolutely none. But I guess we've got to turn these all on before we, it looks like it's making waves, doesn't it? Oh, I see. So you can get up to here. Just guess you get up to these, do you? All right. Well, that was a bit cheaty. Put some more anvils here, and I'm not going to leave those behind. Not that it's a bit much of a problem to take anvils. It's just a. So I didn't pick that one up. Well, that means I haven't got my magnet with me. Let's make sure we've got my magnet with me as well. Now what? Was that just flowing water? Do I have to go into this? Well, it just looks like flowing water, doesn't it? Oh look, <laughs> plants. Oh, there's a mob over there. Oh, maybe it's locked. Do I have to open this thing somehow or other? Yes, yeah, plants, food, bread and sand. Okay. Another brick that's on fire. supposed to sort of put blocks down to go over here okay more doorways hmm still don't know what they do <laughs> Of somewhere now, where are we at the top of? Can that gas not see me? Uh huh. So, look what effect have I got? Night vision for resistance, strength. Okay, something or other. Well, if that's a gas, it might not be such a good thing because I've got my gas outfits. We got. The Reckless Tower Gas Deceiver. Okay. Well, I suppose what the idea is is to come along and to keep going through these. Look, look a bit like a maze, don't they? So let's get more nether rack here. Well, this is uh, nice and confusing. <laughs> I 
Sounds like something's dying. Oh, I suspect the August is in this tower. So how do I get into this tower then? Other than break it. And there is a mob if you break it, so probably not a good idea to break it, is it? Hmm. You know, I've got no idea what to do. Looks interesting. Since there's a doorway up here. I don't see much point to that. <laughs> hmm. What have we got here now? This is different. Of course, with the climbing glove, which I've got in my... What have we got here? Just skeletons. Oh, and a spider. And I don't know that spider can see me. Let's get, make sure he, if he can, then he can be dealt with. I kind of like brooding. Or something. Yeah. They don't seem to be attacking me, so I'm not going to bother attacking them. But there is a chest in here. Let's break this. What have we got in here? Okay, I would so it's not interesting. A tower key. Ah, that might be important. A knockback two book, that's not too bad, and some steel leaf. Oh, I did kill a ghast, so it was just an ordinary rare ghast. So what do I do with this tower key? Because we have to unlock something, huh? Actually, while I'm here, I'll take the chest, since chests are hard to come by at the moment. Excuse me, skeleton. Uh, what do I do with this tower key? Is there anything down here? Well, this looks like another exactly the same type of place. I guess there's another chest in here, isn't there? So let's do that same thing again. Let's actually check the chest. What have we got here? Experiment 515. <laughs> hmm. No idea what that is. Let me come out to one of these. What's on the top of these things? Anything or nothing? You know. Let's go down. Where are they linked to? Well, this looks like promising, doesn't it? So if we go down here, I don't even need to defeat these gas because of my thing, do I? Is there anything in there? Another one. More of the same. We can't take it all. So let's just get rid of some stuff that we've got. Picked up some load of rubbish, as expected. I think this one's a good place to put up stuff, isn't it? I've not got shift and tabled. Well worth keeping those with me, I think. Okay. So I need to go keep going down. We've got your spawner. Okay, well, I've got my, um, I've got my thing with me. What have we got? Oh, it's a black one, but he doesn't seem to be attacking me. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my. I think it's in the fourth one, isn't it? Take a another one spawned. Let's just break this and break the spawner. Bookshelves. Actually, well, we're taking the books, let's do those. 
I need a silk pickaxe for the hopping like that, don't I? Now, am I back in the main tower here <laughs> or not? It doesn't look big enough, does it? This looks bigger. So the main tower's in that direction, okay. I don't know what this pad does. is broken. We've been here before. Much of the same stuff. That's interesting. It didn't actually pick up the um, the chest this time. Feather falling three. I did quite a few books from here. Where's the chest gone to? There must have some chests here somewhere. Leave that in my inventory. Hmm. I might give up and go and do it the, the easy way. There's supposed to be a mob from that as well. not opening. Ah, we were here before. Now what do I have to do to open that? I'm sure there's a combination of things we have to do here to open these things. But for the life of me, I can't figure out what it's going to be. Doesn't look like anything down here, does it? Yeah, I've been here. Hmm. So what could be triggering this? I suppose we can get through here, can't we? And bypass the door. <laughs> Very cheaty. Well, this is definitely the middle of the thing here, what's in here. Nothing. So where are you going when you do this? Don't see witches around. We don't seem to, ah, I was going to say, we don't seem to be going up. What have we got here? More of the similar sort of stuff. I might as well take these double chests. It looks like the right place. But we have been here before, have we not? Uh-huh. 
Oh, so whenever I break these, they turn into something nasty. what I'm doing but these are not good because I'm not going to be able to get out of here <laughs> well I can always get out because I can teleport probably break these bricks in the middle can we oh no they always turn into something different how about the floor <laughs> whoops ah I wonder nope that's not working either well I'm a bit stuck Tell you what, let's break the one that's directly below us. Well, can't activate that one. But when you activate these, they make some steps, don't they? That's going down. What's the point to that? Unless, I don't know what I'm doing. I think I probably have to do some more research. I don't know what the intention is either. It doesn't seem to be obvious as to what we're... I'm supposed to turn on all these torches or something like that. That would be one possibility. Yeah, this is a challenge. sure it's something you do like this but I've got no idea what it is because these things are transmitting rays across well there's definitely a boss around here I can see him look there but what do I have to do to open this stuff up tell you what I'll have a bit of a little quick bit of research and come back right I have to find all four keys there's not just two I found two we have to go and find four of them, so we have to go back out of here. Oops, somebody can see me. <laughs> uh, pinch beetle. So, I tell you what. I will not, I'll come back in a while when I've found the four keys. See you in a minute. Well, I found the August, <laughs> as you can see. I got some keys, and then I came up here and saw, saw all these things. I have no idea whether this is... We have to do it, but we could try it. I've got some some bits and pieces. I really don't know what we're supposed to be doing here. Whether this is a... Well, I'll tell you what, we'll go and sort out the August first of all. <laughs> It looks like a bit broken up. 
There he is. Let's get the sword in hand and start shooting him. Oh, he's dropping gas tears. Really? Let's get underneath him then. <laughs> I know what I'm using at the moment is my... Um, There's fiery tears or something. Well, that wasn't exactly uh, or inspiringly difficult. Where's he gone to? What have I been picking up? Gas junk tier five. Well. Some XP down here. These little little gas, but I don't need to attack them because they're. <laughs> or do I? Because they can't see me. Ah, it's doing something. Let's kill these guys off then. Camelite gaslings. Okay, they're different. Strength 2 makes a difference. 32 in one hit. What's this thing doing? A ghast trap. Hmm. I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> Isn't that appalling? I know you've got to pick up the fiery... Get rid of these flames. Gas trap. I've got to pick it up. Axe. What did I pick up? I don't know. I picked up a, an epic shit grab. Shit, not another one because of the a gas trap, Twilight Forest device. Okay, I'm still stuck. We have to pick up something after we've done the the boss, and I'm just not sure what we're supposed to be doing. Oh, what's in this chest here? Ah, here we go. Fiery tears and the trophy. Now I'm got enough space. Let's just make some space. And I've got these somewhere. Where did that just disappear to? Over here, huh? Tell you what I could do. Let's open this up. I think I can put in armor and stuff into that. It says you've got to pick up these things. Okay, I'm not exactly sure what that means, but let's put some netherrack down here so everything doesn't fall all over the place. In fact, let's do it like this. Just make a little platform for this. Don't really need any blocks on there, do we? So let's remove that one. Now it says you've got to pick up these, so let's just pick them up. So we have our fiery tears, an org, and some calm calm carmenite, and an orgas trophy. Now, what that should do, if this is correct, is we can go basically and f find it out. We don't have to mess around here. That should allow us to go to the snow by snow area. 
Look at those things. But they don't seem to drop anything useful. Tell you what, let's take this out of here. And the gold armor here. But actually, that's got some good enchants on it. Soulbound 3. I didn't know there was a Soulbound 3. And a Soulbound. <laughs> and Breaking 3. Soulbound and Breaking 3. Okay. I'll leave them here then. And there's another device here, a gas trap. Well, I'm going to have to look at what that thing does. I'll try and remember it's there. So let's go back to the map. So I've sorted that out of the way, and the map is somewhere about here. Magic map. Oh, this one is opened here. So the next bit is the snow area over here. So if we can go through that. I'll go down a bit while I'm doing this. That's so easy actually. Too many keys to press all at the same time. So that's the dark forest. I think it's completed. Hmm. There must be another Hydra there, but I think we've done that one already. Now, this is a bit where it was staying like crazy before, wasn't it? And what have we got in here? Lots and lots of mobs. Oh, I don't think I want to be here just yet. <laughs> Even though I guess this is a boss. The Alpha Yeti. Okay. Well, I'm going to do the Alpha Yeti today then. Let's go and do him. Oops, one. So what's happened here then? What? Oh, I've got to kill him. Is he, kill is he dying? Or am I stuck? Oh, that's okay. Oh. He was a bit easy, wasn't he? <laughs> yeah, I tell you, this strength to enchant on this armor is amazing. I've just done the Alpha Yeti, has he given me something? An Alpha Yeti fur, okay. Well that seems to be like all of it. Very strange. Okay. These guys don't actually attack, why not? 148. Oh, it does actually attack, okay. Throws you up. Three hits, he's gone. Oh, bats. How much, how much health this one got? Go on, let's be brave. <laughs> Twenty one, fifty four is oh, another heart from him. Okay, well. Tell you what, it's time to get back home. So let's do that then. I'll have a bit of a bite to eat in the mean in the meanwhile. And let's get out the what have we got here? Ice bombs. <laughs> I think the uh the warp stones in here. 
so I might as well just warp away back there wasn't exactly as difficult it was more of a puzzle wasn't it so we need the overworld base let's go there I need to empty out my stuff let's what so and get rid of here like that let's put this back into here let's take these hearts 57 health is not going to be a problem well I think it's probably about the end of this episode I hope you've enjoyed it well it's sort of a bit strange I'm not too sure what I'm going to do next time is some more astral sorcery and I'm also going to have a quick look over here see how this uh, botanical mine has been doing I'm not sure whether this is chunk loaded to be honest with you oh it's chunk loaded it's definitely chunk loaded can I sort that Okay, so it's completely full of leaves. <laughs> oh dear, I didn't really want to be full of leaves. Ooh, what's up in there? Hey, eh? there must be a mob around here. Oh, him. Okay, well, I'll sort him out from here. I didn't expect, I didn't think, hopefully, he was going to have this guy around, but since he's a Yeah, thank you. So where did it come from then? Trying to destroy my stuff, I don't know. It looks a bit it looks a bit my inventory looks a weenie bit on the full side. I'll forget you for I will have to find out what I do with that if there's anything special. Anyway, this is full of leaves. I probably should chip the leaves straight into I don't think they've got any use as these leaves. Let's have a look anything special is what I mean we can put them on a runic altar to do what I just to make okay runic altar that's no big deal most of it's just what can we do we can do a tree beacon of course I'm not going to bother doing a tree beacon so I really need to get rid of these leaves so what I'm so what I'm going to do between episodes is pipe the leaves out of here into a probably just turn them into dirt I guess so we'll do that in and then next time I'll have a, a little bit more look at um, Astral Sorcery. I think I'd like to complete all of that stuff. So until then, bye for now.